how to fix the issue where your wired keyboard is not working in Windows 11. So if your keyboard's just not responding or it stopped working, then I'm gonna show you how we can go and solve this issue. Now, the very first step is to open up the start menu on your computer. You then need to go and search for control panel and click on this window here. In the top right hand side, make sure view by is set to category and then click on hardware and sound. Underneath power options, select change what the power buttons do. Then click on this change settings button that are currently unavailable. And you need to make sure turn on fast startup is disabled like so. So this should be unchecked. And then you can go and press save changes at the bottom of this screen. Now, once you've done that, the next step is to go and open up the start menu again. Search for device manager and click on this window. Now, if you can't search for device manager, you can always just right click on the windows icon and you can just go and select device manager from here. Now go and expand the drop down arrow next to keyboards and you should be able to find your wired keyboard in this list. Now, all we need to do is go and right click on it, click on update driver, press search automatically for drivers and check to see if that solves the issue. If it still doesn't work, then right click on it again, click on update driver, press browse my computer for drivers, select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer and then you can just try all of these different options in the list to find the one that works for you so i'd recommend just going through each of these and pressing next and if that still doesn't work you can right click on your keyboard again press uninstall device then just go and press uninstall and once you've uninstalled this, you can go in and restart your computer. And once your computer restarts, that should go in reinstall the latest drivers. And you can go and check to see if that solves the issue. Now, if you have tried all of these steps and it's still not working, the final solution is just to try using a different port on your computer. So if you're connecting your keyboard to a USB port, for example, then try using the other USB port on your laptop or computer. Sometimes that can also go and solve the issue. So that's it, guys. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.